Hi and welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be a little bit different. I'm working on a series of videos and it's going to be like my makeup collection. I started buying makeup more seriously in January of 2017 and I became addicted right after that. So I have a ton of eyeshadow palettes that I acquired. I started off with just one maybe. Um, I think it was a Dior palette that I bought a while ago and that was it. And um, I've got a few, um, enough that I'm gonna have to do like four or five different videos. So I'm gonna group them my type. If you're interested, please continue watching. Um, at the beginning of each video, I'll do a little video clip, tiny clip of showing the, the palettes we're going to be looking at for that video. I will show you the palettes and I will give you how I feel about the palettes. Um, some are high-end brands, but I don't like and I don't go to hardly ever. And some are unknown kind of brands, but they're amazing. And I wanted to share all these with you. So stay tuned, keep watching. Um, if you like, please like, comment, and subscribe. If you're already subscribed, thank you. I appreciate you. And let's start with the first one. So I'll start with Juvia's Place. I have less of those. And let me find them to show you. Okay. So Juvia's Place, I have six palettes. This is the Magic palette. Let me first tell you about Juvia's Place. Um, this company is, is simply amazing, the way they send their product. Their, their um, shadows are inside, the palette is inside the bubble wrap, inside the box for the palette, and then it goes inside bubble wrap, inside another box. So when you get this thing, it is going to be very hard to get it broken, which so they really take care of how they ship um, their stuff. And I love the way the colors and the pictures they have up there. It's amazing. It's beautiful. The packaging is is solid and sturdy. Um, and the colors ridiculous like they have amazing, amazing colors in every single palette. So these are the colors in this magic palette. Actually, this palette I won. Um, I didn't buy this palette. I actually won it from a um, Facebook competition on a Facebook page that a group that I'm following. And um, it was pretty cool that I won this in the end. So that's the magic palette. You saw the colors. The pigmentation is amazing. The texture is amazing. They are so blendable. I love these. Um, in fact, sometimes I think they're too pigmented because um, it depend if I don't put um, enough primer on my eyelids, my eyelids actually stain. That shows you how much pigment these things have. So that's the Magic Palette. You saw what that looked like. And I have, let me see, the Nubian. There's two Nubian palettes. There's a Nubian 1 and 2. This is the original Nubian. Of course I love this. I'm originally Egyptian. This is so cool. That might be why I love these guys so much. Okay. So, that's the Nubian 1. This one is more kind of the browns, the beige colors, brown colors, so it's got those types of colors. Uh, they do have mattes and shimmers, so it's a really, this palette is a good palette where you could do like any look from beginning to end with this one. So I like this palette for that reason. You see I did dig in a little bit in it, so I've been using it a bit. So this is the Nubian 1. And then they came after it with Nubian 2. One thing about these, let me see if this one has it. This one doesn't have it. Nubian 1 doesn't have it. Some of these um, palettes, they have names for each of the shadows inside. And some of them are really good names. Like, they're pretty cool names. Like, let me see if I can find here anything. No, this one doesn't have anything that I'm uh, trying to show off. 
So this is the Nubian 2. Let's look in here. I think this is the one that has like Egypt and stuff. Yeah, this is the one. So this is how it looks. And look at these colors again. Gorgeous, gorgeous colors. Just simply beautiful. It also has the mats and the and the shimmers. Now the problem with this one is that it doesn't have the light beige color. So I'd have to, you know, dig into another palette to use it. But it's, it's just beautiful. The colors are amazing. And this one, this color is called Cleopatra. And this one's called Nefertiti. How cool is that? And then this one's Morocco, Madagascar. So all these Nairobi. And there's Egypt. This beautiful, gorgeous green color is my home country. Yay! I love this color. So this is the Nubian 2. So that's the second Nubian palette. Now, again, like I said, I didn't buy everything. Um, so there is, uh, so this is the Masquerade, and this is Masquerade Mini. I think they had two versions of this, the bigger size and the smaller size. And I adore this one too. Look at this. The, look at these colors. How gorgeous are these colors? Look at those blues up there. Look at that. Oh my God, I love, love, love Juvia's Place. And these have names like Mali, Dahlia, Zola, Cairo. Has Cairo in there. Casablanca, Giza. So it has, you know, they use pretty nice, pretty cool names. I like how they name them after cities and, and pharaohs and stuff like that. Next is something, this came out a few weeks ago i'm gonna say a couple of months maybe yeah near the end of last year and this is the saharan 2 palette um i don't have the saharan one but i got this saharan 2 because of this picture i was like i am going to buy this finally someone is representing the hijabis so i'm definitely gonna buy this and the colors are again gorgeous look at these amazing 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 the bottom three are mattes so they're darker mattes again you still have to dig into another in my opinion palette to get your crease and your base and stuff but these are really nice for your corners, um, the outside corner of the eye. So I love it. This is another one. So this is Saharan 2. I'm hoping I'll end up having the whole collection. I just haven't bought the others yet. And last but not least is my most recent acquisition. They had a sale at Christmas. So I ended up buying the Zulu, um, Zulu palette, um, now this one, I hadn't bought it for a while because of the kind of colors it has. It's just like real popping colors. And um, I don't typically use those bright, bright colors, but sometimes I have a, have a need for them. So I'll, you know, I, I, I'll end up using them at some point, but I'll probably be using more this one, that one, maybe these, that one and that one. These two, I'm going to have a hard time trying to use for sure. This one, I probably would still be able to use. So this was the Zulu palette. And that was it for Juvia's Place. I hope you liked what you saw. If you did, please tune into the next video because the next video is going to be the ColourPop video. Please hit the notification button, like, comment, and subscribe. If you've already subscribed, thank you. I appreciate you. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye.